I just want to say that I'm here making another response because basically I was basically defending myself for reasons I didn't have to. And, but at the same time, I realized that, that bisexuality is a big clause in the gay community because frankly, you know, it's, it wasn't a choice for us. You know what I'm saying? It wasn't like, oh, it's women and men. It's just, it's just men, you know, like if it was in my perspective, you know, or with just women, if it was just in a female perspective, but the bisexuals, they have a, a greater range and um, basically, it just only proves that, frankly, yeah, again, they, they are killing us with HIV and, and AIDS because, frankly, they realize in that lifestyle that they're not happy, that they're never going to be happy because you never, ever quite made a decision in your life to do anything that was going to motivate you in a positive direction. Um, I can't say there's any other place in the world that it condones bisexuality except for America and probably England, probably China and Japan, but, you know, out of the very few, they're, you know, they're still like America. But, you know, at the same time, I realized that maybe I spoke too soon. Maybe I was jumping ahead of the gun and not really paying attention to the title. And basically, it's true. It's true. Without a shadow of a doubt, people running around fucking everything is just trifling. And basically, triflingness begets triflingness. I'm sorry to say, but if you're going to be fucking everybody, you you might as well use a condom. And sometimes you don't. And then they, I mean, really, on a real up and up level... I mean, how, I mean, on a real level, I don't even know why they are bisexual. I don't care to the degree. I just don't know how it happens. Like, who left the gate open? It's not right. I don't believe in bisexuality, I guess, because I really, I really am not a fan of the bisexualness because I believe it's really rude and, and trifling and because frankly it shows that you have no care for no one else's emotion. Now being bisexual is one thing. Being able to understand that you there's rules to relationships, there's boundaries and stuff, maybe maybe that would make you a better bisexual. However if you're still gonna fuck someone else when you're fucking somebody, you know, and you don't even have to be in a relationship, but if you're gonna fuck somebody else and then do and expect that to be a relationship, it's not. And basically, that's not a relationship. And um, basically, for you to bring that not relationship into a relationship is very disrespectful to not only yourself, and everybody around you, but the person that you're dating, being that they may not be bisexual or not. And basically, I agree with you. I just have to say it. Maybe research doesn't really stipulate the bisexual people. So basically, they're either categorized as straight or gay. And in my degree, they should only be categorized as that because whether they are gay and straight together, they was gay and straight at the time, wherever the fuck they was doing. I'm not going to say they have the, any, they don't have better, they have greater chances of catching HIV and AIDS than any other by um, sexual orientation in the world. So again, I can only applaud your video, but at the same time, we have to come through with the information, like the fact that they are just, I mean, they're just not really wanted and then like I just really really just want to put that out there that sometimes maybe they should not that bisexuality should not be condoned amongst gay people either because frankly I think it's condoning an open door policy in controlled environments you know what I'm saying when you're in a relationship 
you want to feel secure that the person that you're with is interested in only you. Not cheated on you because he has an open door policy. You know, and you don't want that if the person was gay to go around and 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 give you a, you know say oh i'm gay you believe in this person is with you and then oh turn around and have sex with a woman then he having children with this bitch i mean it's not right it's not condonable it's just not it's disrespectful to everyone and bisexuality i would really like tell them to take the l to take the g and drop the b and just leave it lgt because bisexuality is like the gateway to the lake of fire, and that's the burning pit of hell. Golly, and yes, I had to take that long to get, because sometimes, I don't know, but bitches is crazy, and you just can't say almost everything you want to say, but sometimes they really need to understand that they don't really understand the decision that they're making. And I try not to consider bisexual people by their gay for the time they're gay, they're straight for the time they're straight. And uh, when I, I don't dig bisexual people, I just basically, you know, they just get whatever the hell they get and then they move on with their lives. I don't really, no, I don't tolerate bisexuality as a relationship clause. I don't. I respect them, don't get me wrong, but at the same time, if you're going to be bisexual, try to have some respect for yourself and the people around you. Have respect that when you're dating someone, dating someone, and you want them, and they want you to be monogamous, that you're supposed to be respectful to their wishes and that you will want that for yourself too. That monogamy is the cause of being in a relationship, not the fucking third wheel of someone else's fucking relationship, for real. So, just some words. Um, I agree with you. <sighs> and frankly, you know, basically, you know, the gay part that really blow took me out. But again, bisexual is the most burning people in the world. And basically, you should decide to be more respectful to yourself to make a decision. Like, if you're going to be with women, be with that woman. And if you're going to be with a lot of women, and try not to mix and match. This is not no motherfucking candy. Okay, you got to be respectful. These are real people. And y'all have a great evening. This is your local blank sponsor. <laughs> you know, drop us knowledge and correct us some things that went wrong. Out.